All right, viewers, let's begin with the latest news break that's just coming in. The Enforcement Directorate grilled Aishwarya Rai Bachchan for just over five hours at its Delhi office. Aishwarya was asked many questions over the Panama Leaks case. This was Aishwarya's third summon. Earlier, she'd skipped summons, citing personal reasons and even sought more time in the infamous Panama Papers leak case. Exposed a few years ago, alleged that Aishwarya, her father, mother and brothers were allegedly appointed directors of an offshore firm, Amic Partners, in 2004. She's accused of allegedly parking her money in tax haven Virgin Islands. All right, that's the latest that we are getting in. Aishwarya Rai Bachchan left the Enforcement Directorate office just and two hours ago in Delhi. She's going to be summoned again. This was the first round of questioning viewers. This case pertains to over 15 years ago. Her husband has also been called in for questioning. But what is interesting is the period of investigation for this particular, particular case, Aishwarya Rai Bachchan wasn't married to Abhishek Bachchan. But having said that, she is accused by the Enforcement Directorate. The allegation is she parked her money in a tax haven country, the Virgin Islands, where she was the director of a company which was dissolved in the year 2008. But it has political implications as well because what's gone down viewers is what you saw is Aishwarya Rai Bachchan who was grilled by the ED in Delhi that was outside parliament inside parliament as the green ED was grilling Aishwarya Rai Bachchan her mother-in-law Jaya Bachchan had a big meltdown in Rajya Sabha after being poked by BJP over the interrogation of her daughter-in-law in what was clearly monumental rage Inside Parliament, a very, very angry Jaya Bachchan urged the Speaker to take action against the statement made against her and Aishwarya. She was targeting the Treasury bench. Something was said by someone from the Treasury bench which provoked a reaction by Jaya Bachchan of this nature. Listen in. <laughs> I think, I think you are not what interested. Are I think you are not interested. I'm calling the next member. I expect you to take action on the comment that he made about me and my children. That, that, no, that will be, that will be. You that, want to be fair, is, you're sitting on the chair. You don't belong to any party, sir. You do justice or you tell the whole house and the that you don't need to do it. He made a personal I'll tell you what went down. This was a Jaya Bachchan inside Parliament asking the Speaker to take action against whom? Against the members of the Treasury desk who were sitting there. Somebody had made a comment on Aishwarya Rai Bachchan being interrogated by the ED, which clearly her mother in law, Jaya Bachchan, who's a Samajwadi party. MP in Rajya Sabha and one needs to underline that viewers because the Samajwadi party has also taken up cudgels for Jaya Bachchan saying that she's being targeted because UP is going to election and she's their representative in the house in Rajya Sabha. But this was Jaya Bachchan on fire inside the parliament right minutes after that. My colleague from India today. Yeah, what you think, huh? I don't want to make any personal comments on anyone. Whatever happened was unfortunate. They should not have spoken the way they did, and which got me very upset. So let's quickly get you the latest update. Aishwarya Rai Bachchan will be summoned by the ED is what we are getting to understand. So will her husband, Abhishek Bachchan. There is politics attached to it. The Samajwadi party says that the Bachchan family is being attacked because Jaya Bachchan has been vocal of late. She's been shown wearing the red cap outside near the Gandhi statue outside parliament supporting the 12 MPs who are protesting and this is vendetta politics. But the Samajwadi party is also talking about vendetta politics, especially on the count of misuse of government agencies and wiretapping.